the lower facial evaluation is what kind of jawline you have because if you have more of a retruded mm -hmm. retrusive chin you have less skeletal support you typically have your muscles that are angled in a more vertical orientation you don't have this 90 degree neckline and and then as the tissues become more uh, lax, then um, you begin to see the outlining of the muscle. Unfortunately, I'm getting that a lot now. Um, and you see the bands of these muscles. And um, one of the things that we do is to, um, even though in nature, this muscle, which runs along the lower jaw and along the collarbone, never meet in the midline, in nature but what we do is we actually bring them together and then release here and then take the tail of the muscle and and attach it back here and that creates a hammock to define the jawline and um, so that's you know we're always looking at that anatomy and how we can accentuate it and um, sometimes people have excess fat in this area and that also can give you this sort of obtuse neck look and there's fat above and below that muscle and we make that determination ahead of time as well before uh, approaching it.